Brought to you by Wendy's. Recognizing and celebrating the excellence of the next generation. Welcome back to the Wendy's High School Heisman Awards and the special moment. Let's now meet Natalie McEwen from Woodland Hills, California, which borders the Santa Monica Mountains in L.A. Natalie is another straight A finalist. You have to go into this mental state where you're just completely devoted to the game. That's what I love about sport. You can just tune everything out. Growing up, we had some really extensive financial burdens come along, and it's been really difficult to make ends meet. Just simple things like paying a water and power bill to being able to pay for sports gears, like these are all just challenges. And that was really difficult for me because I didn't want to admit that, you know, I was different from my peers. We couldn't afford to put him into a camp or anything like that, but we had to swim thing through the local park system. Sports has been this amazing opportunity to push myself, to make myself a better person. It doesn't matter what research paper you have due in the next week or any of the stressors at home, it's just the game. I strongly believe that the best way to escape poverty is through an education. My dream since third grade is just to get to college. And I realized I really have to work hard for this. It isn't going to be handed to me. Kids in this area have a little bit more resources available to them. And that's not really the case for Natalie, but she makes them available. She comes to the school early in the library using the computer. Sometimes it is difficult, but I don't want to let hardships define me. If shedding tears would help lose weight, I'd achieve my goals. I've cried so much this week. She just continues to amaze us. She's going to do great things in this world. We have to pinch ourselves and say, is this really happening? I'm just so proud. Just because I don't have the same funds that everyone else does does not mean I can't be a straight-A student, can't be a scholar-athlete, because it's all about you. It's about defining yourself. I really want to pursue a career in international relations and political science and hopefully use that for the greater good of my community, help support people growing up with financial burdens, and just give back. Ladies and gentlemen, Natalie McEwen. Congratulations. So, um, what do you think is going through the minds of the second row right there, right now? My parents are definitely my biggest support system, so they're very proud. Surprised my mom isn't crying yet. <laughs> <laughs> she will, trust me, or she, or she already has, right? I know. Um, what do you think, when you look at your studies and your commitment, and that is going in early and then doing stuff after school, what do you think that means to your family? I think it means the world to them. You know, they both put so much work into raising me and getting me involved in scouting and giving me many of the opportunities that I've had to be able to like run a nonprofit organization for Southern California and to be able to compete in sports teams when they didn't have the funds to pay for them. And like, I'm sure they're just over the moon excited for me right now, just like everyone else back in California.